the screen fades in, and from a dark stage emerges a humanoid figure taking a step forward. Back in 2021, when Elon Musk revealed the idea of a full-fledged robot, he became a laughingstock to everyone. By 2025, it became a reality, and people all over social media are posting stories on how their jobs could literally be replaced by robots in a few years. With the release of the new Tesla Optimus Gen 3, the company has revealed human abilities never before seen. But the question arises, is this actually happening? I, I think, I think uh, humanoid robots will be the biggest product ever. Uh, the demand will be insatiable. The background. To understand Optimus Gen 3, we must go back in time. Elon Musk has always framed Tesla as more than just a car company. Cars were simply the first step, and if you know Elon, he's always thinking a century ahead. While the world focuses on tackling issues like global warming on Earth, Elon is already making significant strides in his mission to Mars. Moving forward to Tesla, the company's biggest strength has always been its software, AI, and robotics. Behind it all is the real-life Tony Stark, Elon Musk himself. In 2021, Musk announced that Tesla was working on a humanoid robot, and while the concept made sense, it was all in theory. But according to Elon, if the world accepted a self-driving car, why wouldn't they accept a walking, talking robot that would seem like a human? So at first, the world had this very overwhelming picture of what Tesla was going to make with the Tesla Optimus. But the first reveal was quite underwhelming. It was literally a human in a spandex suit dancing on stage. It's real. Uh, the Tesla bot will be real. Um, but uh, basically, think about what we're doing right now with the cars. Uh, Tesla is arguably the world's biggest robotics company because our cars are like set semi-sentient robots on wheels. Social media was filled with memes, and again, Elon was turned into a clown. Others compared it to the Boston Dynamics robots, which were already showing off their impressive parkour-capable robots, or the robots that would literally shoot a gun. But even so, Tesla wasn't kidding. They were slightly pushing, quietly, iteratively, year after year. The prototype moved closer to something that we all believed would be real. The Tesla Optimus Robot Generation 3. Just imagine a 5'8 robot striding into your living room, weighing a little 104 pounds, down from the 125 pound earlier prototype. The surface would be shining, and the robot would be looking like you just brought the most high tech from the Back to the Future movie. That's the upcoming Tesla Optimus Gen 3. While the release of Gen 3 has already been teased on social media platforms, people are already talking about Gen 4. But what are the changes in this iteration? The Optimus Gen 3 will feature a signature golden shell, a distinct contrast to the matte grays and whites of yesteryear. However, don't dismiss its uniqueness because Tesla has still managed to make its robot lightweight, rugged, and optimized for the task. At its core, the Optimus robot will be made from an ultralight aluminum magnesium alloy, weighing just 2.7 grams per cubic centimeter, which is nearly 65% lighter than steel. In other words, this material makes the Optimus Gen 3 much slimmer yet tougher than many other robots in the industry. Shell durability, you ask? Well, it laughs off temperatures above 200 degrees Celsius while hitting a pencil hardness of 7H, which is twice the scratch resistance of standard paints. But why did Tesla go so hard to add these materials? The answer is simple. By adding carbon fiber and peak blends with just a density of 58% of aluminum, they were able to shave away 10 kilograms of weight from the previous prototype while also slashing energy draw by 15 to 20 percent and on top of it all increasing the battery life from eight hours to a total of 10 hours this is perfect for a full shift folding laundry and flipping burgers without a recharge things like these create a lot of fear as well since we all know these robots are coming for us but why the golden accent you see one of the tweets that tesla did said the future is golden and this shows that they want to launch the Gen 3, or what they are now calling the Gen 2.5, as a symbol of luxury. With a friendlier face, smoother contours, and rounded shoulders, this time, the robot will look less like a Terminator coming to destroy us, but more like a friend, an ally, or someone we could all use in our everyday lives. But now, to the part everyone has been waiting for. What exactly does the Optimus 3 or 2.5 do so well that it is being compared to humans? Human Abilities of Generation 3 
As we've talked about the luxury exterior, the brain is where Gen 3's real power comes in. Forget the rigidity most of these robots are known for because this robot comes with real human abilities. Start with the head. It comes with a redesigned dome packed with eight high-resolution cameras. The previous Gen 2 had six. With eight cameras, it can deliver 360-degree vision at 30 frames per second. Fusing with multi-directional LiDAR and ultrasonic sensors, it can do sub-millimeter precision, which is perfect for surveillance. Even prepare breakfast just like a real housekeeper. This is what Elon Musk announced about the next-gen Tesla. So, in the next five years, if we see these robots all over the bank, protecting people and money, don't be surprised. Gen 3 Tesla robots can track a moving object, let's say, a spilled coffee, while sorting recyclables and responding to voice commands. These robots can also process 10 simultaneous data streams without a hiccup, and Tesla's neural net, which is trained on 1 million hours of human motion capture, can fold laundry with 95% accuracy while monitoring a child's play area and alerting via Grok integrated speech. But stats are the one thing that would paint the full picture. You see, the Tesla 3 can go 8.05 km per hour, which is much faster than Gen 2's 5 km per hour. Moreover, it can cover 40 kilometers on a charge, running at a maximum speed. Tesla has added gyro-stabilized joints, and thanks to that, it recovers from a 45-degree push in just 0.2 seconds. On the hands, we have 22 Duff Dexterous Grippers that can thread needles at a 98% success rate, pick fragile eggs, and thanks to XAI's Grok, you can ask it any question, like, when is your next date, or what's the weather like this weekend, and it will respond immediately. To take things to the next level, it can rival human hearing even in noisy environments with a success rate of 92, and this is just the early demos we're talking about. Extended operation? The Tesla Optimus Gen 3 can have a 10-hour runtime, and unlike other electric manufacturers, it's not just fluff. In one of the battle tests, the robot was run for 24-7 shifts in logistics, where the Gen 3 had to sort 500 parcels per hour, which was double the amount they had compared to last year's Gen 2. The results? Well, the Gen 3 did its shift with less than 1% error rate. In healthcare, it can assist with vitals while multitasking patient chats, potentially cutting nurse workloads by 40% as a 2025 McKinsey report on humanoid ROI showed us. And these aren't mere parlor tricks because the world is changing. In the broader context, what makes this a game changer? Where humanoids like Figure 01 and Aptronic's Apollo lag in multitasking, Optimus doesn't just perform its task with flying colors, but its accuracy and overall technology blow every other humanoid of the present out of proportion. This begs a fundamental question. What's the price tag that the Optimus Gen 3 is going to come in? The price tag, where cars are costing hundreds of thousands, with full options costing even more, Elon Musk's 2025 target will shock you. According to Elon, a price of $20,000 to $30,000 at scale would be their goal for producing these robots. This is cheaper than a used Tesla Model 3, and the main reason for aiming for such a small price tag is so that everyone can afford it. Production costs could be well around $10,000 a unit using Gigafactory efficiencies, while AI chips could cost around $500 per piece, and the actuators could be $200 each. These are some numbers that have been going on in the humanoid industry so far. But what's the progress? By 2027, Elon expects $15,000 models of the Tesla Optimus Gen 3, which would be cheaper than a semester of college while flipping labor economics on its head. You see, the Gigafactory Texas isn't just producing Cybertrucks every second, but it's also ushering in a robot revolution. Mass production of these robots is expected to commence in late 2025 with approximately 5,000 to 10,000 units intended for Tesla's internal use, including factory operations and sales. However, in 2026, we can expect it to scale to 20,000 in numbers for partners like Amazon warehouses. By 2027, the number could easily reach 100,000 per year, leveraging EV lines, and Elon's goal for 2029 would be to produce at least 500,000 units and 1 million by 2030. 
While these numbers are ambitious, they are not unrealistic. Several news channels and anchors have said that Elon might be too ambitious, but according to Elon, it's just a matter of time before everyone will be willing to have an Optimus in their homes or workplace. So, what jobs would the Optimus Gen 3 replace by later turning into Gen 4? Job replacements. In theory, once the Tesla Optimus Gen 3 robot becomes normalized in our society, it could potentially work 18 to 20 hours a day with minimal downtime for charging. This efficiency, combined with the fact that companies could own this robot for $20,000 to $30,000, makes it quite a cost-effective solution compared to human labor. In the future, we can already predict Tesla bots replacing roles in repetitive, hazardous, or low-skill sectors. As Gen 3 excels at repetitive tasks such as part staging, welding preparation, or quality checks in factories, it could replace up to 80% of the assembly roles, as seen in Tesla's own facilities, where these robots are already sorting and folding. In a video, one of the electricians who worked for TikTok, Amazon, and Tesla told everyone that it would kill 80% of jobs in various sectors, like restaurants, electricians, and more. And don't get us started with warehouse and logistics, because that would be completely replaced by the Optimus robots. From picking, packing, and inventory management to locking docks, all the steps where there's a safety issue, these robots will do their job perfectly, but would come at the cost of replacing human labor. Since we've already covered the full range of human abilities these robots possess, we can see that they would also assist in various aspects, including cooking meals, cleaning homes, and even babysitting children. Elon Musk has already highlighted that abilities like walking dogs or monitoring kids would threaten domestic workers and entry-level caregivers. You can imagine like your own personal robot buddy uh, that is uh, a great friend, but also takes care of uh, your house, will we'll clean your house, will mow the lawn, uh, will walk the dog. And how can we forget the video of Optimus roaming around and exploring places it has not been while adapting to the environments? What's even more innovative is that multiple robots can share understanding of their surroundings while communicating with each other to stay adapted to their environment, making it look like a scene from a science fiction movie. Just look at this video here. By putting things in a box and moving around without causing any issues, the Tesla Optimus 3 is truly a big innovation coming to change human lives. What do you think about the future of Tesla's Optimus lineup? Will Generation 4 look and feel like humans too? Or will Tesla keep the same design language? Let us know in the comments and subscribe to our channel to stay up to date with the latest tech news.